Hello, record nerds of the internet. It's that time of the month again, although it's a little past that time of the month. But I've been busy because the holidays are coming and some holidays have already passed. But let's talk about the new records I bought. Coming up. Six in the morning. All right. Well, we'll start with the records that came in most recently. I have sort of been getting out of the jazz thing, but then I saw this on sale and I had to buy it. Miles Davis, Sketches of Spain. This is the Mono Pressed at RTI. I got this for like 16 bucks on some sort of Cyber Monday sale. I bought some records for the kids and I saw that and I'm like, I'll grab that. I also saw this. Bad Religion, How Could Hell Be Any Worse? This is on some color of vinyl. This is their first record. This is, this is probably their worst record. I'm not gonna lie. There are some good songs on here, but like, I don't know. Let's open it up and see what the record looks like. All right, so it has an insert. That's kind of cool. Let's see if it opens up. It has some lyrics. Which is cool to see out of reissue. Sometimes they get that wrong. And then, so it's on this sort of smoky, clear color vinyl. All right, and then, so that's all I got from that. I've really tried to bring down my record purchases. That is until um, Vinyl Community College had a record sale that I bought a bunch of records from. And it's a bunch of stuff I don't normally listen to. So let's go through that. So this is Black Curse. That's what that says, even though you can't really see that. Endless Wound. I haven't listened to this. Um, I believe this is on black vinyl. Yes, nothing to see there. It has oh, a very thick insert. Oh. This is not an insert. This is a printed inner sleeve. Um, I'm guessing this is some sort of metal. I don't remember. He was selling a bunch of metal records and I was like, you ever get in a mood where you're bored with everything you listen to and then you're like, I want to hear something different. That's all well and good until you buy a whole bunch of it and then it's just overwhelming. And then you don't bother to listen to any of it. That's where I am with this. So I haven't listened to this. This is a band called Bayrit, I believe. It's B-E-H-E-R-I-T. It's another metal band. Another record I have not listened to. Also on black vinyl. There is an insert as well. And then I bought a whole lot of records from a band called The Body from our friend. Here's one. No one deserves happiness. Um, seems a bit extreme, but you know, they're an extreme band. So and this is on this really cool color, like pink sort of translucent vinyl. This is a double LP. Gatefold. On Thrill Jockey Records. Here's another one from The Body. The Body and Brave Young. I don't know who Brave Young is. So this band is very like sludgy doom metal sort of stuff. Which may or may not be your thing. I'm not even sure if it's my thing. But I bought it anyway. Mental Wounds Not Healing is another collaboration between the uniform and the body. This I believe is also on black vinyl. Yes, and no insert on this guy, so kind of unremarkable otherwise. I like that cover for some reason. Here's a body record. This is a double LP. Oh, double 
think that will, yeah. Double record. This is the album, All the Waters of the Earth Turn to Blood. And this is on a, a sort of a gray, translucent, smoky color. And here's another body record called, I don't know what. Oh, this is a split or collaboration with a band I've never heard of called Krieg. This is on clear vinyl. I'm not gonna bother to show you because everyone knows what clear vinyl looks like. This looks like a happy indie rock band. Alas, this is The Body and Big Brave. And this is on blue vinyl. Oh, it has an insert or a printed inner sleeve. That's what that is. And then it's on clear blue. The body, master we perish. And then this is the body and a band called Thou. Also on Thrill Jockey, double LP, double 12 inch. Um, this one has a pretty cool booklet that comes with it. A lot of interesting pictures. So again, this is very like doomy, sludgy, sort of metal. And then the last record I bought from Fred was this Holograms record. This is more of like an indie rock, sort of modern pop punk, sort of, not pop punk, post punk sort of band. It has an insert. So that was all the records I bought from Mr. Putterman. And the last record I bought was this, Show Me the Body. This is their new record. This band is really cool. I don't know that they get enough love or, I don't see a lot of people talking about Show Me the Body, but they ought to, because they're pretty interesting. Imagine this is the, they put this upside down. So this band kind of sounds like if Black Flag, Bad Brains, and Death Grips got together and had a ugly child. It would sound like this. And this one is the limited edition on like orange and red vinyl. So check out Show Me the Body. I already showed you the body. Now I'm showing you, show you the body. That's funny. That's it. That's all the records I bought this month. Maybe next month I won't buy any records. It's probably not accurate. Have a good day.